Good morning, CNS. Today is Wednesday, December 6, 2017, and it's a D-Day, and I'm Jamie Kane. And I'm Megan Trivia, and this is the CNS Morning Show. Good morning, everyone. Today's act of kindness is to do something for a friend or a family member. We'll be right back to you after this. <laughs> Emoja is running its annual socks, gloves, hats, mittens, scarves, toiletries, and underclothes drive for children and families in need in our district. The nurses and social workers at Roxell and Rox Middle are grateful every year for your contrib contributions. The need is as strong as ever this year, and we are hoping you have the opportunity to help our younger students and their families. Contributions can be brought to room 113 anytime until December 20th. Emoja is showing hidden figures today and tomorrow after school in room 113. This movie recounts the dramatic events surrounding the invaluable con contributions of three African-American women that made the American Space Program possible. Free refreshments are offered. The library will be closed today during study halls and lunches. It will also be closed today after school. Attention students taking the ACT this Saturday. Please do not forget your ID, admissions ticket, calculator, and number two pencil. Please arrive by 7.30. Questions, see your counselor or Ms. Mack in House 1 Counseling. The Career Center will be closed Block 8 today. Students, are you interested in the ROTC scholarship for after high school? There will be an informational session after school at 2.10 on Wednesday, December 20th. This workshop is open to all high school students who wish to find out more about the Military Scholarship Program. Students can register with Ms. Deaver in the Career Center. Attention all seniors, your baby pictures are due to the yearbook Friday, December 22nd. There's a drop box outside of room 153. Don't forget to put your name on it. Seniors, if you are parked, parking on the school grounds without a parking pass, you must report to House 2 Principal's Office to resolve this issue. If you continue to park here without a pass, your vehicle may be towed at your expense. Juniors, you are not allowed to park here. If you continue to park here, you will be towed at your expense. Attention students who took the PSAT exam in October. In the next few days, you will be receiving your test book and instruction sheet as to how to read your scores in your first block class. Your scores will be available online between December 11th and 13th. College Board will send you an email when they will be available. If you have any questions, see your counselor. The canteen will be open early and closed, closing at 6 on Friday, December 8th for the half day of school. Lunch will be served. Also, anyone needing community service hours should stop in and see Ms. Tony for details of upcoming opportunities ASAP. PM BOCI students must report to B246, the LGI, for blocks 7 and 8 on Friday, the half day for a quiet study hall. Bring work. And finally, a message from Ms. Lorenzini to any students who, who drive to school. Be aware of the crosswalks, crosswalks and, stops and stop signs out in the parking lot. According to the New York State law, when there is no traffic signals, drivers must yield the right of way to pedestrians, particularly if a, pedestri if a, stop, if a pedestrian is in a crosswalk. You must stop your vehicle and allow the people who are walking the right of way. Our parking lot is becoming very dangerous. You need to be careful when you are driving in the parking lot. That's all of the announcements for today. Stay tuned for a minute if you desire to check out what Lorenzo has for us on the morning show, Late Edition. It's a working title. From the CNS Morning Show, I'm Jamie Kane. And I'm Megan Trubia. And now over to Lorenzo. Thanks, guys. My act of kindness for today is to bring you the first episode of Runway Talk, a show about fashion produced by our very own Jasmine Velasquez. A while, the models you're about to see could use a dose of kindness calendar. Day 5, the show was very informative. Due to our late start getting things rolling here in the studio this year, the information about the fall season is past. However, it's still interesting to know. So here it is, Runway Talk. Hi, welcome to the first episode of Runway Talk where we'll be discussing all things fashionable and trending from each season. In this episode, we'll be discussing fall and winter trends to look out for in stores. The first big fashion trend is red. 
Red is considered the color of fall 2017. Lots of designers, including Fendi, Dolce & Gabbana, and Givenchy, have been using the color red in everything from daring boots to red trench coats. Another big trend is furs. Whether it's a giant fur coat or a sheepskin vest, fur is in big this year, ranging in all sorts of styles and colors. Designers like Coach, Michael Kors, and Yeezy all have fur in their fall collections. A returning favorite to the season is velvet. Unlike the previous season utilizing mainly black velvet, this winter it's all about making an appearance in bold, colorful velvets. Red, blues, and yellows have been primary favorites of designers like Jason Wu and Tomei. The last trend is a throwback. 70s plaid is making a comeback on the runway. Not only is it used in flannels anymore. Designers like Prada, Tory Burch, and Gucci are using it in everything from dresses to crazy pants. And that's all for the first episode of Runway Talk. I'm Jasmine Velasquez, and I'll see you next episode. Pretty cool, right? Now we're going to switch gears and show you a fun whisper challenge video produced by Jared Neshi, Megan Truby, and Alyssa Avicoli. And now here's the video. My feet smell like stinky cheese. My fish smells like cheese. No. My fish smells like a weenie. My feet, my feet smell, smell like, like stinky cheese. Cheese, stinky. My, my feet smell like stinky cheese. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Senior year sucks. Yes, but no. no. <laughs> Nothing's coming out of your mouth. Okay, ready? Twinkle, twinkle, little. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Yeah. You got it. She should get that mole checked out. Did Gigi shut the lights off? No, she didn't. <laughs> she. Tricky. She, she. No. She should. She. She should. She took. Should. Shuck. Should. <laughs> she? She? Okay, she. Should. <clears throat> Shuck. <laughs> no. She should. She should. Street should. Sure. No. <laughs> Mole. Bowl is at the end. Bowl. 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 <laughs> Paul McCartney was great. A pumpkin? <laughs> Paul Blarney. <laughs> Paul. Paul. Paul McCartney. Barney. <laughs> Paul McCartney. Bunyan! <laughs> Bunny? <laughs> bought a donkey! Paul bought a donkey! <laughs> Paul, Paul McCartney. Blarney? <laughs> McCartney. Bjarney? <laughs> McCartney. B. Harvey. Paul <laughs> McCartney. I don't know Paul! <laughs> Paul? Uh -huh. I got Paul. Wow. <laughs> McCartney. Is Bernie close? What? Paul McCartney was great. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen those elephant shoes? Did you see the fish with shoes? Have you seen those elephant shoes? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> I get really scared in haunted houses. I'm really sorry. I really need to go to the counselors. <laughs> I get. I can't. I get. I can? I get. I can't. <laughs> and now I really need to talk to the counselor. Houses. 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 I, I really want to. No. <laughs> I get. Can really? No. No. I get really scared in haunted houses. Haunted houses! Yes. I, I get really scared of haunted houses! Yes. <laughs> <laughs>
Nice job, Miss Shelley. So that's all for today. Remember to do something kind for a friend or family member. From the CNS Morning Late Show Late Pass, I'm Lorenzo Thompson. Wow, why did I say it like that? <laughs>